Man, USC just got stumped the fuck out by Notre Dame, man. Stump the fuck out. I mean, God damn, if this was Minister Society, this was Kane whooping Chauncey's motherfucking ass. Man, and ain't nobody to snitch on for USC. Can't turn the tape in to the police department. Uh, you got to take this first loss of the season. But, uh, man, Notre Dame really set the tone with defense, man. This defense was fucking everything, man. And they really smacked around that offensive line of USC's and got to Caleb Williams, man. Caleb was trying to make shit happen, and all it was resulting in is sacks, and he ended up throwing three interceptions in this game. It just wasn't much they can do, man, especially when the defense of Notre Dame up front was just vicious and a motherfucker. But that's the way you're supposed to play this shit. It's the way you're supposed to play it, especially when you have such a talented quarterback that you see with uh, USC, man. Such a talented quarterback, you got to make the go the game hard for him and also take away the running, the running uh, uh, game. And they did that. But you had some spectacular moments, man. I like the kid out of... Uh, Bishop Gorman, man, that branch kid who ended up rolling, uh, you know, kind of setting shit up with, with some of the special teams play where it brought USC, I think, when they scored off of that uh, drive within 10. And then right after that, you have Notre Dame run this motherfucking kickback for like 90-something yards, man. And then it just went downhill from that. From there, you had a fumble. Dave and Foos run that shit in for a touchdown. Then in the next drive, they create another fumble. End up fucking, did they score off a kick? No, I think they let the time run out. But this is just what what defense shows that it can do for a team. And that's to go in there and pull off incredible wins. But uh, this has been some dope-ass fucking football from the high school level as well. Definitely the college level. That NFL shit, I don't know because I don't be watching that bullshit. But uh, that's all I got. They too busy propping up Taylor Swift and bullshit like that. That little fruitcake shit that they got going on in the world. The NFL is transgender is just in the motherfucker. Y'all keep hyping up Taylor Swift because she dating a motherfucker who's already been good at football. But that's all I got. Peace.